Hello everybody and welcome back to Nier Automata. Now this is just an extra set because obviously the main game has been finished, but this is going to be looking at the Arena DLC. Uh, I've done a fair whack of it with 2B, and as you can probably tell from my level, I've been doing a fair bit of grinding, which is half the reason why there hasn't been a like an update for Nier in a little while, because it took me a while to grind that. It took me a little bit. Once I got to a certain level, I could kill the sort of boss bunny statue creature for a little bit, which helped, but uh, otherwise the rest of it was kind of the old-fashioned way. Lots and lots of robot murder. Now, the reason I'm going to be showing you the last parts of it is because there's some interesting developments in it and uh, just generally quite cool. And with any luck, you'll see me win and uh, get 2B's costume, which would be nice. 2B currently has uh, dark hair here. Looks quite nice. Suits you 2B. I, I think I prefer the sort of like the white hair, but uh, still looks nice. We can give her lots of different coloured hair purple, yellow, gold, sort of red. Be a red headed 2B should we want to. Which is what some of the rewards we've run the one from the arena. There's a little bit of story behind the arena which I kind of wish I'd captured, but uh, that ship has sailed unfortunately. But uh, what we're gonna do is sign up. I'll show you what the like the arena is kind of like. So let's do rank E first of all. Let the battle begin. So we just generally murder these machines. These ones are pretty weak source. The only rule is we... Yeah, the robots are a little bit upset. But so there's basically, this is what the fights entail. There isn't, I wouldn't say there's like tons of cutscenes per se, but the little robots do talk uh, and generally get slightly more disturbing as things go on. They're not too keen about being uh, sort of chucked into the arena to be exploded, I don't think. I mean, I don't think I'd be very happy about that either. The music dynamically changes. And this is what 2B's arena it sort of entails. I don't want to see you guys suffer, that's why I'm kind of crushing you very quickly. And that's how it goes. Generally, it's three to five. Thanks. There's generally three to five kind of like, uh, oh, nice, sort of waves of enemies. What I'm going to show you now is the very last one. Now, this is tough. This is a level 80 one, which I had to grind a few levels to do this. Warriors of the S rank. Today, I want to see you revel in the glorious and refined combat arts. Show no mercy, grant no quarter, rip and tear and gouge and poke and slice and crush and maim and destroy! Now fight! The androids here are also a little bit warped. Now, as you probably noticed, these guys are not really attacking you very much. They want to live in peace. Music, sir. Pretty miserable. I didn't kill your daughter personally. I'm using a different uh, sort of plug-in chipset, as you probably noticed. Uh, allows me to get some sort of interesting witch time dodges off and things, which is kind of cool. Ooh. And I heal a bit more efficiently in this, in this set as well, which is kind of nice. I feel really, really, really bad for the robots in this. They've been basically kidnapped off of the uh, streets, as a lack of a better word, and forced to fight here. I mean, nothing in Nier is particularly cheery, but again, this uh, sort of compounds everything, doesn't it? So I want to kill the sword brother first, probably. He's pretty. I wouldn't say they're weak, but uh, we can take that quickly. However, they are very, very strong. So if we fluff up any of our dodges, they can be pretty painful. Music just sort of doesn't help with the misery, really. Right, this is where it starts getting very, very tough. So every time we get a successful dodge, we can get away, which makes this a lot easier to deal with. Because this fine fella who's level 85 is very, very dangerous. Here we 
go in that one. I need to there we go, move there so we can get some taps off on these guys. Then move again. The skill I'm using is called Overclock, by the way, which is the perfect dodge to give us a nice quick timer, which helps against that insane skill there, which does an awful lot of damage should we be anywhere near it. So basically, the last thing we want to do is get involved. Ooh. Oh, I took a bit of a hit there. It's not too bad. i got to be very careful, though, because one more slip up like that, and I could easily be on the receiving end of the game over there. Just get away from that guy. Okay, we can actually finish this guy off now. Probably. Nice. Just the older fella now. Oh, I say the older fella. It's the guy who looks like some sort of robotic Olaf from uh, Rock and Roll Racing. But let's see if we can, what we can do with him. Get up nice and close. Dodge the axe attack. Ooh, need to get away. We're not allowed to use any items in this arena. I can't remember if I said that. My concentration and dodge again. Dodge again. Oh, my dead. My dead. Oh, I'm dead instantly. Damn. And that's what happens when we fail. Now, what I'm going to do is, uh, yeah, we don't actually lose our chips or anything, but uh, I'll see you there in a second. All right. So back to these three fellas through the magic of editing and uh, perseverance. And oh, let's uh, try not to get horribly slain again instantly. That would be grand. And yeah, people were like, well done, Halloween, you did it the first time, yay, but I didn't, so sorry, my bad. But uh, still, it's the uh, Perseverance accounts and, uh, well, uh, that machine murder. Ooh, Ooh we've almost got one down. I uh, really need to... Yeah, okay, that's one. Let's do that, and then we'll grab them both together. Ooh, this... Uh, ooh, that was a really bad idea, and I got very, very lucky. I got away with that, though. Okay, dodge. I'm loving overclock, by the way. It's super useful for this. Okay, let's get this guy out this time with precision and skill and not dying. That is my number one. Run away! Run away! Run away! Run away! I mean, you could just... I wouldn't say cheese him, but sit back and shoot him, which would be semi-effective here, but... Uh, also, nowhere near as... Uh, near, near as fun. I think my other chips has some defensive stuff in there, which actually helped me. Ah, no, 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 that's not what I want to do. No, tubes, tubes, stop shooting the man. I want you to dodge. It's my reflex for shooting the second I get in front of Waver. Come on, man. Oh, oh, that could have gone horribly wrong, but we survived. And, wah, nice. Finished. We're done. We're done. Indeed we are. Congratulations! Here's your reward for clearing the S-rank battle. It's a revealing outfit. I'll show you what that is in a minute. What's this? This is a piece of revealing women's clothing that humans used to wear. With clothing like this, you have to wonder why they even bothered wearing anything in the first place, huh? That's humans for you. Anyway, take it. It's yours. Talk about exciting! By the way, I haven't seen a battle like that in forever. Hey, you want to see something interesting? Have a look back there. You'll love it. Before we have a look back there, let's sort to be out. So, firstly, let's go to the key items and change our hair to uh, white, which is the original colour. Swing! And then, because this is important, of course, we're going to scroll up again because this thing's really awkward. And I'm going to put on the Lunatier. And then, going back into the menu, I really wish it would just stay in the menu. Uh, we want the revealing outfit. Da -da -da. There we have it, folks. It's Kaine's outfit. It's just as revealing as it once was. Yeah, it suits you to be. It doesn't look very practical, but, you know, nice callback. And it is pretty difficult to earn. I mean, requiring level 82 is, uh, well, 80 at least. You can probably do it at 75 if you're pretty skilled, but, hey. Suits you. Especially with the, uh, the Lunatir there. Anyway. What have we got here? This is what it all sort of culminates to. Like, you still will see rumours of, like, that, like treating these robots quite badly, but then there's no real surprise, is it? Huh? This is unexpected. It's a prison cell for uh, machine life forms. Help me. 
Help me. Now then, which one should I choose next? Eee! <laughs> Stupid machines. Look at them, quaking in their boots or whatever they have. I love it. These little bastards killed eight of my subordinates. Every resistance member here lost someone important because of the machines. Some saw their loved ones cut to pieces. Others had their friends eaten right in front of their eyes. Do you blame us for getting together in a place like this? I'm thinking of taking a few of these guys and dunking them in water. Might be fun to watch the sparks fly. A little light show might be what the, me uh, the mechanic ordered. Well, you up for it? Pass. Oh, come on. Don't be such an old lump of iron. You didn't forget your bloodlust when you were trashing these guys earlier, right? Well, this is the same deal. Only difference is whether you kill them here or you kill them on missions, you know? Eh, whatever. This is wasted on you. I don't know. I think there is a difference there. Analysis. The androids in this arena are exhibiting unusual emotional depth. Hypothesis. They have begun to inherit the cruelty inherent in humanity. Huh. We talk to this fellow here. Excuse me, I have a favor to ask of you. I'm just a feeble machine, and there's no way out of this hell for me. So, would you mind killing me, please? My family is gone, and I have nothing left of value. I'm tired of having to live through the same nightmare every day. I know this might not sit very well with you, but could you kill me, please? Well, as per friggin' always, near is as cheery as it comes. Now this is- that was 2B's arena, uh, all the way to the end. I don't know if there's any extra stages. I do think there's extra stuff to see in the arenas. I know we're- we prepared a special new rank for you. Hope you like lots of pain. This is meant to test your actual skills so your auto chips will be disabled. This is your chance to show the world what you're truly made of. Oh, you know what? Let's have a look. Special rank recommended 99. Let's have a friggin' look, shall we? Hmm. So, you made it this far, huh? Alright. Then I think you're ready to face the next challenge. This is the ultimate, completely insane can you overcome the odds? Ready? Fight! Probably not if they're level 99. We have a we have a 130. Jeez. I don't think I can even scratch these guys. No. I think I need to do a bit more leveling first before we can uh, crack that out. Damn. fine. Cool. So yeah, that's the arena. Uh, there are, like I said, a few story beats that well, unfortunately I missed, but uh, hey. Uh, what we're going to be doing next is trying to grind up to level 99, get all of the weapons, and upgrade them all to level 4. That will probably take me a little bit of time. Hello? What's this? Ooh. Well, that was freaky. I wonder if we finish all the arenas where we're all uh, unlock, unlock something interesting. But that's a tale for another day. And, uh, yeah, a tale for another video. Thank you very much for watching. I do hope you enjoyed this, and uh, I'll see you all again next time. Till then.